You're from? The Central African Republic. And you've been living in Korea? For a year and six months. For a year and six months? Yes. How, what did you do in Korea for a year and six months? So first I was at Sogam University. Oh. I learned Korean. I see. And because my goal was to stay here long term, mm. I knew it was very important to start. That's right. That's already. right. I guess because you can speak Korean pretty well. So now I think you have a better understanding. But do you still find something different or something awkward? Of course. You know, a lot of things are different. Things yeah. are awkward. But at the end of the day, because I'm here, okay. I just have to adapt. Okay. I have to accept. You know, you can achieve something, you just accept it. Ah. And then this is the reality of the country, the reality of the culture and the people. Wow. I just accept it. It makes my life easier. Okay. Something very stupid and silly. <laughs> yep. For example. When Korean people eat, they make so much noise. Ah, In my culture, when you eat, you have to be very quiet. You're right. But they make so much noise and it used to annoy me, but then I realized that's the way they show how much they enjoy the food. Right. So I just accept it. Now you can do that? No, I don't do that. But I accept the fact that it's happening and I try not to think it's a big deal. I see. Even if now you understand it, but it's still for you, it's a little bit difficult to do yeah. it by yourself. Yeah. Especially when you have noodle, right? Drink soup. And then you, 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 you get so much air in your stomach. I'm like, why would you do that? But then again, that's the how we appreciate the food is really good. Exactly. And Things are like that here. Yeah. Um, I like the freedom I have here. Oh, what? Okay. As a foreigner or? As a, as a foreigner, I just see. as me, Leila, in general. I see. Um, I don't want to say a different person, but mm. there are certain things that I allow myself to do I and see. experience here in Korea. I think this is more about yourself, not about Korea, exactly, right? Exactly. No matter what it's countries, like as long as you live foreign countries. I think it's yeah. just like the way Korea makes me feel. Oh, you feel when I came here the first time you feel more comfortable. Yes. That, that's quite interesting. So the way it makes me feel, that's what I like the most about uh, Korea. The way Korea makes me feel. <laughs> Maybe in the past life, because many Koreans, we I do think, believe in the past life. In the past life, I think so too. you would be a Korean. I, I, think, I think so too. It's fun mm. to get out of your culture and your country and your people and your habits just to experience something different. Wow. And uh, so I've done that since I was 17. So I'm used to it. I you see, know, I going see. to America, I had to adapt as well. Okay. So this is like just another challenge I'm taking so, on. But at least here, I choose to come to Korea. Oh. My dad sent me to America. So it wasn't a choice. I see. But wow. Here, it's like a decision. I gave you up everything made. that I had just to come here and uh, You're experience such a my person. life. So, oh. yeah, it's exciting. It's exciting. It's not beautiful every single day, of course, because it's light. You know, sometimes you have to eat bondegi right over there on the street. <laughs> because I can now, I smell bondegi. You know what bondegi? That is a bondegi. That is a bondegi. You never tried it before? This is a single. But this is a, has a, a lot of protein. That's what I've heard. And then, actually, it's quite tasty. But, you know, it's looking at this and they imagine this is a worm. You wouldn't dare to eat it. But actually, once you get used to it, not bad, actually. Oh, oh my god. You want to try some? We have some, this is a kochi, right? Kochi and hot dog and potato stuff. And that is also tora from the sea, little sea seashells. You know, I think, I guess, you see, you've been living in more than a year. But still, there are a few things that you never tried oh, before. I see. And the udang is really popular, right? You tried yeah, udang before, yeah. What I have noticed is that you're kind of deep person, really. <laughs> I can see that. Yeah, you think a lot. And I, I do, yeah. Uh, you see, you try to see more than the surface. Absolutely. Wow. It's my life. I take responsibility for everything I do in my life. And I, I want to make sure I live a good life, a life uh. I'm proud of. So. Even, you know, yeah. coming to Korea, you already been here two yeah. times. Then made made a, you're, you're right. Yes. And then you also started learning Korean too. Absolutely. Wow. It's all in the plan, you know. I don't think I would have been able to move here without mm. visiting the country at least mm. twice because you kind of have to come and see what it is and see right, right. fantasizing mm. about it. So I came and I saw and I and You came it. and then you kind of felt right about. Yes. Here, here you are. Thank you. <laughs> the next time, make sure you try some bandagi. <laughs> <laughs> there are more exciting things that are waiting for you, okay, uh, you know, great. from living in Korea. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.